hi guys welcome back to my channel so um this is going to be part two which is the element spread so a lot of you have been kind of questioning what you know what's happened to the element spread at the end of the readings i've had to kind of try to condense my readings and make them a little bit shorter because they were taking up too much time you know if you think i have to do all 12 signs every month and on top of that i have a day job and i do my private readings so you know it was taking a lot of time and if you think you know i do everything myself so i have to edit the videos and upload them and yeah you know it it was just taking up a lot of time so i decided to try and make them shorter however i do understand that people really loved the element spread so i'm going to do it as a part two and i hope you guys enjoy it so we've got aries leo sagittarius with fire signs i just want to say even though it says king it's not gender specific it can relate to a man or a woman okay so um, i'm going to start with fire aries leo sag then move on to um air signs which is aquarius gemini libra so yeah and water signs um cancer Scorpio and Pisces and then Earth signs Taurus Virgo Capricorn so let's get into the readings hi Aquarius so let's get into your reading so let's see what's going on for those of you dealing with fire signs for September 2018 what's going on for Aquarians dealing with fire signs for September Okay, so there might be some arguments, there might be some conflicts, okay? What's going on for Aquarians dealing with fire signs for September 2018? Okay, the hanged man. So you two are arguing because you're not seeing each other's points of view. So they need to see your point of view. You also need to maybe try and see where they're coming from to resolve any arguments. What's going on for Aquarians? Oh, okay, so this literally flipped out like that. So there is a soulmate connection between you and this fire sign. Okay, so, you know, even if there are arguments, um, the hanged man also can speak about learning our lessons as well, okay? Because if you look about, um, if you look around his head, he's got this, illumination coming from his head so it means that yes he's kind of been put on pause he's been put on time out but he's learned his lessons so I feel like any kind of arguments you and this person have it's going to help you both grow and you still have a very strong soulmate connection okay what's going on for Aquarians dealing with fire signs for September 2018 yeah, the magician, okay. Clarification on the magician. So you guys are manifesting something or someone is trying to make something happen. Clarification on the magician. Okay, so you guys have what it takes to heal this situation, okay. So even if there has been arguments, it's like you know what to do to heal the situation. You know what to do to make it less stressful. The Four of Swords is about seeking relief from stress, taking time out, healing. Okay, so you know what to do to heal the situation. You know what to do to keep the soulmate connection. Okay, the, ma the magician has all these tools on his table at his disposal, okay? So he has the emotional intelligence, the, the intellect, he has the stability and he has the um, motivation with the wands as well because wands are all about movement, they're all about action. So you know exactly what to do to solve this situation with this soulmate Aquarius, okay? So you know how to get past arguments with this person or if you don't know right now, then you will know um, in September. So let's see what's going on for Aquarians dealing with fellow air signs. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with air signs for September 2018? Aquarians dealing with air signs for September 2018. 
the Knight of Swords, okay, so you're rushing towards this person or they're rushing in towards you. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with air signs? Okay. Ten of Wands. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with air signs for September? The world. Okay, so you are ending a cycle with this person and I feel like it it's kind of been a little bit erratic it's been very hard work and it has been something that's been very burdensome to you so you are going to get closure on this situation and you might just start a new phase with this person or a um negative cycle is going to kind of come to completion what's going on for aquarians dealing with air signs for september 2018 Yeah, okay, so there's a need for change, but it's like you're resisting it, or the person you're dealing with is resisting it, and it's like there's this stubbornness. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with air signs? Yeah, okay, so some of you are ignoring problems between you and this person, or you're analysing the situation, or you're in two minds whether or not to proceed with this person. I'm going to pull one more card. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with air signs for September 2018? Aquarians dealing with air signs for September 2018. Yeah, okay. So some of you are going to be putting the work in or wanting to put the work in. And I feel like you're going to be patient, but you're still kind of... Um, I feel like in September you're kind of thinking, do I just end this or am I going to be patient and wait for this person? Because again, you're analysing the situation, you're kind of in two minds. Do I end it or do I continue to invest in this situation that actually is just hard work? You know, this person is stubborn and they are a little bit erratic. So... Let's move on to those of you who are dealing with water signs. So I'm just going to reshuffle my cards. Okay, what's going on for Aquarius dealing with water signs for September 2018? Aquarians dealing with water signs. For September 2018. Aquarians dealing with water signs for September. Okay. So you are going to put the work in with this person. Or they're going to put the work in with you. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with water signs for September? Okay. So you are going to work on your relationship with this person. You're going to work on a commitment or work towards commitment big um commitment energy here what's going on for aquarians dealing with water signs yeah the king of pentacles so you're focused on your money you're focused on your finances but at the same time you're still working on your relationship so i you, you know i feel like you do have a good balance okay what's going on for Aquarians dealing with water signs for September 2018. Aquarians dealing with water signs for September. Okay. Yeah, okay. So I feel like this situation, I'm not seeing it ending, but I don't know if this situation has been kind of stressful. So... Um, if you have had issues in the past, it's kind of healing. It's slowly becoming less stressful between you, between you and this person because with the Eight of Pentacles, it's like you're trying to work on things. It could be as well. Um, this won't resonate with everyone, but the Four of Swords and the King of Pentacles and the Hierophant could be, oh, and with the Eight of Pentacles as well, it could be that you're having to take a break from this person due to work reasons so that could be a factor but 
I do see a commitment energy, okay? This person's focused on their career, they're focused on their money, but they're also willing to put work in for a relationship. But it might just be slow moving because you do have the four of swords. So it's a bit of a timeout. So let's explore that quickly. Let's find out. Clarification on the four of swords. Clarification on the four of swords. Clarification on the four of swords. Strength. Okay, so some of you are healing from a situation and you're working on forgiveness okay so yeah so if there has been issues between you and this person i feel like either they're going to forgive you or you're going to forgive them and yeah i feel like again you're working on your relationship with this person so now let's see what's going on for aquarians dealing with earth signs what's going on for aquarians dealing with earth signs for september 2018 Okay, so this was flipped out like this. So you are going to have some kind of victory, some kind of success. This person might even pay you attention or you might give them some kind of recognition, but this is a victory card. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with Earth signs for September 2018? Aquarians dealing with Earth signs for September Aquarians dealing with earth signs for September. Okay, so you do have some victory, but you're very um, cautious or guarded or suspicious of this person. What's going on? Ooh. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with earth signs for September 2008? okay loads of cards just jumped out then so i'm gonna shuffle what's going on for aquarians dealing with earth signs for september 2000 and the devil hmm. why is it the devil here clarification on the devil page of wands fool okay i see why you're kind of of suspicious because the person that you're dealing with you will have victory but it's like with the um devil it's like feeling bound feeling tired feeling trapped so it can also mean um kind of toxic situation so you're so you're wanting to be free in this situation this can play out either one of two ways either you want to be free with a page of wands this is about passion excitement new opportunities the fall taking a risk leap of faith new beginnings so and then the devil was kind of restricting that so either you're just not feeling that free in this situation or on the other side this person could just be a complete wild child and they could be into all kinds of um, dangerous adventures. So take what resonates um, with that, you know. But the um, devil does kind of speak about, yeah, just anything kind of toxic, dangerous, that kind of thing. And then we've got the Page of Wands. She's very, very adventurous. She offers um, opportunity for excitement, passion, adventure. And then we've got the Fool. So some of you are taking a very dangerous risk. When it comes to this person, despite there being victory. This is interesting. Let's pull some more cards. Let's see what's going on. What's going on for Aquarians dealing with Earth signs for September 2018? The High Priestess. Okay, so use your intuition with this person, okay? The High Priestess um is someone who keeps secrets so you might already know something about this person 
okay um if it's not that then be very wise with this person because i feel like they're being very wild at the moment and there's a potential for them to lead you in just a, a um into some very dangerous situations and that's never ever ever come up in any of my readings before so yeah and i've been doing readings for ages now so yeah it's interesting um so i hope you guys enjoyed this reading don't forget to like comment and subscribe i hope you have a brilliant september and i will speak to you soon bye aquarius